Assembly Member Hall, please. Thank you. Good morning. Um, Keir Starmer has said that he wanted to um, hit the ground running. Fair enough. Um, and I saw a minister last night that said that they'd been working on plans for months and months. Therefore, I'm surprised that you haven't got your requests in there while they were all working during those months. Um, and that's in relation to what Assemblymember Gareth has said. I mean, the previous government gave you £64 million to recruit 1,000 additional officers last year, police officers. And as you know, the Met, the Met that you're in charge of, uh, was the only police service in the country to lose this money because they couldn't recruit the numbers of officers needed. So if you couldn't recruit 1,000 officers last year, how on earth are you going to recruit 1,300 officers this year, which you said you'd do if you got a Labour government? Well, firstly, the, the minister you heard last night was talking about the months and months of work that went into drafting the manifesto. Now, the results from July the 4th mean the government has a mandate to deliver that manifesto. What happens now, uh, as someone who served in government, is uh, the government works with civil servants to put into action the plans in the manifesto, and that takes some time. So, for example, you wouldn't have heard in yesterday's King's speech 40 separate bills mentioned more than any time since 2005. Every single piece of policy in the manifesto is a five-year parliamentary uh, term. Secondly, in relation to police officer numbers in uh, London, we've recruited more than 6,000 police officers over the last three years. The promise I made in my manifesto was to recruit an additional 1,300 police officers, PCSOs and specials over a four-year mayoral term. And I'm confident we'll uh, keep that promise uh, like I have all the others I made in 2016 and 2021. So how many officers do you think that we'll end up with? I would hope we'd end up with, uh, by the end of my mayoral term, north of 35,000 police officers. North of, OK. And um, are, are the government going to reinstate the £64 million of funding that went back into the government? Well, it's been 13 days uh, since this government uh, took uh, office. I haven't had a chance to meet with the Home Secretary to discuss the issue of finances. What I do know is that uh, Sir Mark Rowley and I agree that London needs more investment in policing in uh, London. We've just seen this weekend the activities in London and why we need additional policing. And I'll be making that case to the new government. Well, I go back to my original point. I'm amazed that you didn't have some of these deals sewn up before the election. Thank you, Chair.